All right, managed to get some food inside me. So that's kind of important. So what do we got going on here? A lot of bullshit. So that's easy dodge. Only two health, so we could just kill that. Tough to get them to attack each other here, though. I guess I could swap these two. That would kill this thing. So that wouldn't be bad. What order do they go in? Why can't I get order? There it is. Doesn't matter. Splash over there doesn't hurt anything. It might actually help. So you're gonna start doing some damage to some mountain blocker tiles. Okay, that would take care of that. What do I do about this? This is bombarding there. Alright, I just walk over there. And shoot there to push them. Okay. Too bad I can't push him left. But pushing them both with one is pretty damn efficient. And then I just barbecue this guy while blocking. It will push into there if I block. I was thinking I'm maybe doing here, but that will block this guy from being moved. And this guy needs to be moved or he does damage to something I care about. Uh, can we get him to kill that in some way? So if I bombard there. No, that's still in the way. And probably the order is wrong anyways. No, it's the right order. It's got to be moved two tiles. I can't get a push on him that way, unfortunately. Alright. I target the building, it won't push him. Oh wow, that's kind of neat. I don't didn't know that. So we go here, target the building. Oh neat, thank you. Oh, but it's not gonna do damage. Wait, why am I thinking this is doing damage? He's not on fire. That doesn't fucking fix anything. Shit. All right. Oh, I needed the push, though. That's right. Because I need the push damage to kill him. That's why. That's why that doesn't work. Okay. Because it will light him on fire for one, and push damage was one. Is there a better solution somewhere? I mean, we're pretty efficient. We're getting rid of two... I mean, we can just move here. We don't have to have them attacking each other. But we kill a guy, and we get rid of two guys, and we get rid of a third guy. It seems pretty damn efficient. I think I'm doing it anyways. And we block a guy as we're doing that. Seems like a really good turn to me. Ooh, nice. We can get both mountains this turn. I 
How do we deal with this guy? Stand there and push him. Can relocate to there. Push him back that way. It's not that helpful to have him over there, though. Problem is I don't have any good things to swap him into. That is the problem right now. Does it still push if I flame like that? It might not push. I think it didn't push, right? Let me double check that. No, no, it definitely pushed. with this guy i just want to light him on fire i think and hit him oh if we do that though we can't get that saved damn okay and two plus one is not enough unfortunately so it's gonna be a knockback again don't really like that I guess I can do small damage by putting him on one of these. To get some kills now. So that's the easiest to ignore. The swap to go there. What's the order? Not good enough. There's four of buildings under attack right now from four different enemies I don't think I have anything efficient enough to take care of that so I can save that can't shoot the building anymore, so I can't push him off of that. Oh, but him attacking that would be pretty fucking good. Do two. Still losing a building. And we're losing the cybernetics lab, which is not acceptable. This guy's already accounted for. I can keep pushing this guy. It takes me a entire fucking action to push him and nothing else occurs. It's not cool, not cool. It's 
So we're taking one building damage for sure. And what's that guy under attack from? Okay. So we'll push him into the fire, I guess. Take damage doing that. No, we won't. to kill four enemies this turn? Really? Seems very unlikely to me. Okay, which ones can be ignored? That one and this one can be ignored. It means these three have to be dealt with. That will do three. I can just hit him direct dead on that would be fine deal with this thing. Push it into the rock and kill it with fire. That'd be two down. And it's just this guy. He's easily swapped away, but I don't get anything out of it, unfortunately. Get a third kill, I guess. Oh, maybe a second kill. Wouldn't kill him. It's not on fire. What is this under attack from? Oh, this guy. Okay. Close, but not quite enough. Too bad. Took uh, building damage there. Only one building damage. Did get a cyber core out of it, though. So, maybe okay. Reactor core, anyways. Alright, I could do with some stuff back. That might be okay. Do we want to go for... Two? I don't want to defend the train. I think I want two of these back more than I want to risk going for that. I think I'll probably end up losing one on a harder mission anyway, so let's go for one of these. Oh, that's a shitty one too, though. Maybe not. Ultimec might be okay with this group. Alright, uh, where are we putting that core?
Probably in here for better range, right? So one more core. So do we have four range now? Or three? I guess we're gonna find out. All right. Nice map that four range. In the web. What does this stupid thing do? Plus one HP. Punch that in the face. Back up and already that. And just swap. So this guy stays alive, but who cares? Everything else dies. Lost a lot of utility with the artillery now doing damage. I wonder if I could, I wish it could get one that didn't do damage to buildings. Maybe it doesn't. No, it definitely does. We need three there. I can move there and teleport him, right? think this is awkward though wow what an awkward fucking turn um can i teleport from there it's my teleport range Grab him. All right. So that's at least good. 
I forgot about throwing people in the water last turn. I could have thought about that too. We already have so many environmental ones. I can't allow that to happen, but I have no way of moving that except for the teleporter. No one else can move that in a meaningful way. Not sure. The RD plus the mech could do it. Walk there and punch him. Mech moves there. Knocks him back. But then this hits. Kills everything as well. But we're uh, dealing with him by teleporting him. So we just lose one. I don't need to lose. I need to not lose another one right now. I have three three threats, none of whom I can kill outright. Or rather, only one of whom I can kill outright. And all three of them have to be dealt with. And I either, this guy takes two actions to deal with. It's really too bad, uh, no, I still wouldn't be well, no. What if I moved him over one, then pushed him? The push still worked at the edge of it, right? So, if I go to here, we go here, already there, it pushes him here. I actually can do it with one. I didn't think about pushing him towards us. All right, let's look at this for a minute. Decent. Doesn't deal with this guy, but we can't deal with this guy. Okay. range infinite now or just four four no it's wait is that an acceptable target am I understanding that correct all right if that's a thing we shoot this guy and we're good just move Did that actually work? No. Okay, it is just four. Okay. And I can just ignore that. It's not doing anything, but I wanted to do damage. I could just take three damage. That seems like a lot. Especially since I'm not supposed to be taking damage. Actually, I'd die if I stayed there. Somewhere I can push the beetle over? I don't think so. So we kill everything else then. One tile away from maybe to teleport him into the water. Should kill him as well. Guess I can put the beetle here. That's still decent. Alright.
How do we kill this? Maybe that's the wrong question. I mean, it's... I guess we could just kill that. This is fire tile. Okay, it's not a lightning then. Can't move there one tile short? Damn it. So I guess it was the right question. How do I kill this? Just hit it directly on and then burn it. Does it do damage all the way out there? It does two. That's enough. reference no it's a battle uh, battle fleet gothic reference okay a little bit of health back not a lot I guess we're going proving grounds next Gotta stop sacrificing HP and get some of that back if possible That's what a pod neat. I should be watching their starting attack range too. They probably couldn't attack me until I moved in range if I started like one tile back. It's just not something I didn't think about. Oh, I'm supposed to not be killing the volatile mech. The volatile vec, rather. Doesn't seem to bother him that he's attacking it. Looks like a shitty turn. Why is it so shitty? I thought we were doing fairly well. Oh, he's gonna kill my pod! No! Push him to there. And we're gonna walk over and burn him and push him further. Yeah! Kill my pod.
I think better to move there and flame the whole area. How many moves? Four. So he can go there. It's probably where he's going to go next round. It's okay. You can get rid of this guy by pushing him off, which would be nice. Get rid of that guy by hitting him with an artillery blast. And then just teleport that guy somewhere where he's not doing a bunch of damage. Or we could be... Wow, oh, we can't be more efficient. Because if we... This guy's splash damage prevents us from having a kind of cool interaction there. He's going later in the turn order, too. Okay. We were we were not we weren't being cruel. We put his fire out. Takes care of that. Uh, if I just burn him, it takes care of him. Can't push this guy into the water, huh? It's too bad. Back up, shoot that guy. I want to use that guy. Can't. All right. Does it matter the order here? It doesn't, right? bad not bad you don't have to activate you don't have to walk in the pod chat all you have to do is just finish the mission to have it so that's fine we get the pod too prime class weapons smash the ground dealing huge damage and pushing adjacent tiles damage four wow that is huge damage okay Am I going to take no money for more shields? Maybe. Maybe not. Uh... Is this 
this thing do? Smash! Yeah, let's run. Let's run that. back online later too all right uh lone mesa lone mesa rather or beautiful corner i guess i kind of want okay i'm not gonna get to do this because the three or three we're not gonna get to do whichever ones i choose here i wanted the one hp but i don't know I'm gonna need a little bit of health. Alright, let's go greeting. I'd like to be able to get two reactor cores and I won't babe to. Might be even get three this way, depending on what I can sell. Uh 